You're very welcome back to the final part of tonight's six o'clock show, where Derry Clark is about to show us the secrets to his Michelin star chicken. Or at Whoa, least, uh, that sounds really good. Is that? Finger licking. Finger licking chicken. <laughs> Derry's finger licking chicken. Okay, I've started. Your fingers because of COVID. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try the chicken the less. Right, yeah, the so uh, the chicken's on the pan for about two minutes, I think, at this stage. Yeah, well, about three three minutes, really, okay. Ray. And um, there's a bit of uh, vegetable oil. Um, I have some mash here, which I put in about 75 grams of butter. Lovely. Right, it's, a really, it's a really buttery mash, yeah. The 50 50. So the mash is done already, so yeah, exactly. And leave that heating up slowly. Have it on quite low heat. Now, this I'm going to put in some. I'm going to turn the chicken over first. Did you do anything special to the chicken apart from put it on the pan with the vegetable oil? Bit of well, seasoning. You know something? It? Yeah, seasoning, salt and pepper. But also, uh, when, they, when we buy chicken in, it usually comes in a plastic you know, wrapper thing. Yeah. Take that out. Never put it in the fridge as is. Take oh. the chicken out. And put it in a place with a, with a, with a, with a, a, um, a napkin or something over it. Why? Why is that? Because um, it's just, I think it sweats in the in the plastic. The cling film it's is. not great or cling film or whatever. Yeah. There's another chef that's not this week as well to wrap everything in a tea towel. Into yeah, or 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 in a um, paper towel. It's fine. Yeah. Yeah, paper towel. And it's like tin foil complete. My mother is like, don't put tin foil in your cancer. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, it's tin foil <laughs> completely <laughs> gone. Potatoes. I remember that. Is tin foil completely mm. not a thing now? We're around food. It is. Well, tin foil is okay for. Yeah, tin foil is all right. It is fine. Ma, see, Mum. <laughs> there he said it. I won't get cancer by wrapping me chicken in yeah. tin foil. Not very sustainable this yeah. day and age, though. But, yeah. but, 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 but you might get COVID. Oh, you might get COVID. Okay, well, sure, look. Well, I've it, had yeah. that one. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Did you have it, didn't you? Did you have it? Did you really summer? have it? Did you? I did. I had it in July. It knocked me for six. You know, miss both myself and Catherine got it. It was horrific. Yeah. And this is horrific. while you were in Portugal, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Seven days in bed, uh, like and and I I couldn't. Not that way, Karen. <laughs> Take your mind oh, out God. of the gutter, Karen. Oh, um, but no, I, you know, I, I was short of breath. And, and even now, like when I go running, my lungs are still not right. Um, so, you know, anybody that takes COVID or the vaccine lightly, worse fool you, because I, I, got, I got taught a lesson over the summer. Oh, yeah. Wow. yeah, for sure. And had you been vaccinated at that point? No. No, I no, hadn't, yeah. no. And um, as I said, it knocked me for six. And I mean, I'm pretty healthy and still I consider myself young. Yeah. So I can only imagine if you had an underlying condition, what it would have done. Oh, it might have affected you. And the spitting you. headaches, I lost my taste, my smell, everything. Wow. Yeah. Well, speaking of taste and smell, this is going to be gorgeous. It smells gorgeous already. Well, you, you smell the smoked bacon. It's lovely. Yeah. And actually, that's, that's a rasher, back rasher, really, smoked, uh, cured. Mm -hmm. um, so the bacon's in there. Just a little I'm using the bacon, hedgehog though. mushrooms. I've never heard of a hedgehog mushroom. They're you slower the to cook. Much. Boy, I think that's Hedgehogs are slow, oh. no? Is that it? No. Okay. Why are they called hedgehog mushrooms? Like hedgehogs eat them, but not spiky. <laughs> no, that's spiky, you know. There's more flavour in them, I think. That's what I do. But any mushrooms is fine with this. Okay. There's a quart of them. I have some uh, the shallot, diced shallot, and some garlic in there. Okay. okay. We're going places. The mushrooms in there. And how would you store your mushrooms then? What's the best way to do that? If you're saying with chicken, take it out of the packaging in terms of veg like that. Well, all veg, you take, you take it out of the packaging. Yeah. There's a sweat in it. Oh. Um, it does really. So, uh, the only other thing is to get plastic containers, little plastic, reusable. Like a Tupperware. Tupperware, but reuse yeah. them, you know. And it works really well, I think. Oh. Okay, so. Sizzling away. This is the one segment, whenever I come back from the six o'clock show, and they turn around, my captain would, because captain does the dinner in oh, our place, shit. I'm not yeah. a cook at all. I say, any chance you picked up anything there? And I'm like, no. Learn to <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm a useless. This I'm looking at even cooking the chicken. Pass. I cremate chicken. Yeah. The fear of God of getting salmonella. That's it, um, yeah. Overdo it, overdo it. Yeah. That's, that's a very Irish thing. Though, oh, it is, it. yeah, yeah. yeah. Again, ingrained in, by my mother. Yeah, high, no, high heat. We were talking so. about that during the week. Once it's cooked at 65 degrees. Like it, meat, it won't have salmon. Not all meat has salmonella. Do you know I know, what I mean? like but it's the to, fear to God that I'll it's get just it. The fear. Yeah, know, yeah, it's yeah. Fear. What's that you're after throwing in there, Dre? Some cider, lovely. Or white wine is fine. Okay. Or apple juice. That's a good we don't want alcohol. You, in, yeah. you know. Now we're in my area of expertise. Do <laughs> 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 you watch alcohol with the voice, though? Uh, yeah, I wouldn't drink on stage, like. You know. <laughs> <laughs> no, but generally leading up to a gig, I wouldn't. I would, I would cut it out. Especially if I go on tour, I would, I wouldn't drink for weeks prior to it. You know, um, but yeah, it, it like it dehydrates you. Right? Yeah, so it like yeah. would dehydrate the voice. So it's yeah. best to avoid it. 
That's why I'll never be a singer. <laughs> uh, as well as lack of talent. As well as uh, not being What was the spice uh, in your dairy? Tarragon. A little bit of tarragon. That's dry. Is, uh, fresh is better. I couldn't get any fresh, by the way, okay. so a little vegetable stock or chicken stock is fine. Okay. And just simmering away all the time. A little creme fraiche. Yes. I put the creme fraiche in to give a nice richness to the dish. Mm -hmm. I thought you would definitely be adding cream at this stage. There's no cream in the go? I will be, yeah, I will be. Oh, there you go. As well, there's a drop there, yeah. Go on, Ray, open that up there you put in here. Make I'll, I'll make us uh, cooking. You're watching dairy cooking. So uh, I just like, drink half that, is it? <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't what put it past you. Bridge? I, wouldn't put a, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't put it past you. Right, go on, darling. Yeah. Uh, away you go, right? No, not too much. And it's just simmer and sizzling in a way. It's fr you and some it tomato. It's so simple and so I easy. Well, I was just thinking that. You look at this and you go, it's so simple, I could do this, yeah. no problem. Yes, I ready. go into the supermarket. Well, you could see. But yes. was that cream you even mentioned there? I wouldn't even remember. Like, but you see, that is um, having all the ingredients ready before you cook makes it yeah. Yeah. much easier. Yeah. In one hand. And we'll be putting them all on a six each just to give it a goo. Yes, it should be on our Facebook page, or you can rewatch it, of course, as well on the player. Catherine, go onto the website there. I'll be home in about 20 minutes. <laughs> You'd be yeah. off did you pick up anything there? I did. Yeah. Yeah. There, right? I'll, I'll pick up the chicken on the way home, Catherine. <laughs> go first. Right. So you so. bring the cream to a simmer, is it? Yeah, what I want to get to now is a kind of sauce consistency. So reducing that pretty fast if I have time. Oh, stuff. Wow. We've got a bit of reduction. We've got a buzzer going around as so well. We do have a fly is joining us. There is a buzzer going around. I tried to kill it earlier. I couldn't, Did you? couldn't get it. <laughs> couldn't get it's it. Full of protein. Don't worry. <laughs> Ray Liotta would have been able to kill it. Oh, Ray Liotta. I mean, yeah, he was good. What wasn't a he? man. What a man. I thought he was going to be in the studio. I was going to wear a three piece suit. <laughs> and then I realised he wasn't. But what a man. Yeah. And he'd only just been in Ireland as well. It was crazy. Unfortunately, it to be over for the premiere. So to hook up with him stateside, but yeah, great. But you notice even talking to him, like, he's, he's serious. Like, you know, yeah. I was scared of him. Yes. Like, and he's probably yeah. a lovely fella. But yeah. even interviewing him, I'm sure you were kind of going... Yeah, he's like 3,000 miles away, and you still feel like... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I will tell you. Yeah. 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 And keep, I say how great the film is. Yeah. I say when it's out, yeah. and say goodbye, Ray Liotta. And it's out <laughs> today, by the way. When he asked Karen to ask to repeat the question, you could see her go. Oh, no, I know, I did. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Scary man. <laughs> so, a little bit more creme fraiche going in. I just did, because I wanted to take it up pretty fast. We're just about time, time. Is run, I know that time is running out of me, so. Time's going to get you. It always does. It always does. Michelin star chicken now? It always does. Okay. Now, maybe I have a, like a sauce a little bit thicker, okay? But again, the taste is there, the flavour is there. Like a little thinner, thick as well, so you, you do it as it suits people. Uh, like I say, you can find it all online on Six Eats. Give it a Google and you'll find that uh, on there. Right. How's I'll the dinner? But mash, look, I love the mm. chicken, but there's nothing like great mash. Yeah. yeah. It's delicious. Such a butter, butter, really butter. Butter. You wouldn't ask me if I had a mouth on me, Terry. No, there's only two portions. Only two. Oh, sorry, Ray, I forgot about you. <laughs> Standing down here at the end. I'll tell you what, I'll, I'll drink the carton of cream. I'm done. It's about looking after the guests. Have right? some time. Go on, enjoy your chicken. Take it home with you. Well, Take it home to the girlfriend. Uh, a massive thanks to all of our guests and to Terry Clark for keeping us fed tonight.